All right, welcome back. So in this video, we're gonna talk about templates. So what I wanna do is I wanna to go to New Note and we're gonna click on the little drop down here and click on Blank Note. And you're gonna see right here, there's a little pop-up for template. So uh, let's click on template. And you're gonna see it's gonna take us to the template gallery. Now, they also have a My Templates gallery which we haven't saved any templates. So to create your own templates, upgrade your Evernote account today. So that requires you to have a paid account and then you can create your own templates, which I highly recommend buying this if this is something that you are infatuated with and think will help you be productive. Trust me, if it'll help you be productive, it's worth the cost. Um, so let's go to template gallery and we're gonna go over um, just the categories first and then talk about a few of them that would relate to uh, what I'm doing in course creation and also just a couple other ones too. So over here on the left hand side we have collections. So you have for life, we have for school, and for work. Okay. Now if you remember when we first created our account we had an option of what we were going to use it for. For life, for school, or for work. Now we selected for work, but you can see here, for work they have an annual calendar, weekly planner, monthly calendar, um, event budget, project budget, meeting notes, get hired, hiring tracker, um, yearly goals, goal tracking, individual projects, social media calendar, marketing plan, uh, travel calendar, story dashboard, um, project goals, so many more meeting agenda, you know, brainstorming session, which was what I was talking about earlier, blog post worksheet. Okay. Um, these are all things actually that I could use myself, like the brainstorming session. I have a lot of those. I'm going to be writing a blog here in about a week. So I'm going to be using this, um, project overview. I'm always doing projects. So I'm always creating courses. So anything I can do to not micromanage it, but divide it up in sections to make it easier to accomplish, I do that. Um, project goals, that's a good thing for me as well. Marketing plan, social media calendar, I really like this one. Um, individual project, goal tracking, I have a lot of goals I set too. Yearly goals, I've done both of those. Um, so this is really a good uh, template gallery for myself because I do a lot of these things that they're talking about. Now for school, if you're in school, um, they have class notes, story premises worksheet, character profile, project overview for school, story dashboard, dorm checklist, that's important, um, novel plotting, three-act structure, um, we've got notes here, and then a monthly calendar, and then an annual calendar, weekly planner, which that's pretty much across the board for all three, for life too. You got the daily planner, the monthly calendar, the weekly planner, all that. Like this one, if I click on that, um, I really like to block out my time when I'm doing uh, courses. Uh, so this is a cool template to use just for that reason. So what I'm gonna do is let's go to delete note, and then I'm gonna make another note. So we're gonna just click on new note and we'll click on template again, and we'll go back for life. There we go. Um, so they got gift tracker, reflect and correct, travel inspiration, lose weight, etc. So there's other ones there. For categories, they have creative writing, okay? Getting things done, individual project, areas of responsibility, weekly review. These are all great things because you can kind of uh, hold yourself accountable and do kind of a checklist and say, hey, did I get everything done I needed to? Home and garden, so gift tracker, menu planning, daily recharge, management resources, project goals, interview scoreboard, marketing and sales, so social media calendar. Again, this is what I'm actually gonna use. Marketing plan, sales pre-call, planner, blog post worksheet, another one I would use, marketing plan as well. Um, meetings, so meeting notes, pre-call planner, meeting agenda, party planning, so event budget, party planning checklist, event feedback, brainstorming session. So all these you could use um, if you're doing a party. Personal well-being, reflect and correct, act locally, um, get hired, habit tracking. 
You can track your habits, your early goals, get fit, support network, old tracking, save money. All these things are very um, helpful and very useful for daily life. Okay, then we have project management. So daily planner, monthly calendar, weekly planner, annual calendar, uh, monthly calendar, uh, planning, project budget, hiring tracker, and then project overview. Okay, then we have school, Eisenhower matrix, Cornell notes, dorm checklist, project overview, and class notes. Travel, we have frequently frequent flyer numbers, travel inspiration, and travel calendar, and then work. So work, we have the Eisenhower matrix. So prioritize all your tasks and to-dos into one of four quadrants. So let's click on this one. This is the Eisenhower matrix. Think of a task you need to do today. How do you decide when you'll get it done? Given all the competition from other items on your to-do list. Use the Eisenhower matrix to help you figure it out where you decide your task falls with a specific quadrant. So when I click on that, you can see, okay, I have urgent tasks, important but not urgent, and then not urgent. So you have kind of like a two section to-do list, basically. Your urgent stuff is here. Um, important, not urgent, decide when to do it. Urgent, not important, delegate. And then not urgent, not important, do later or dump it. So you have like a four tier system here where you decide whether you're going to do it or not based on how important it is. Okay. And the urgency that needs to be used with it. So that is the templates that you can use inside of Evernote. And again, it's extremely valuable to have templates because that means you can get more work done and less building of the template. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.